Hello guys, hope you are grinding real hard and your week had been awesome so far and obviously it is going to be more better. So in this video, I am going to talk about how to get clarity in what you want in life. Because I have so many friends, you know, come and talk to me like, you know, I don't know what it is that I really want to do in my life. And even, you know, other people have that similar kind of doubt that I am not clear on what I really want to achieve in my life. So this is uh, uh, what I'm going to cover in this quick video that I'll share with you that how to get more clarity in what you want to do in life or maybe what you should do in life uh, so that you can figure it out. I mean, yeah, I'm going to share with you a um, few things that will help you in figure out that to get more clarity in what uh, you should do in your lives okay so before getting into that i would like to thank you very much for you know awesome feedback that i got for my last video that i've done from the super trainers boot camp and um in this in that video i told you that i will be sharing and i will be coming with uh, more of the videos so i told uh, it is the follow-up for that video and uh, i'll be doing more of these in the days to come so that i can share with you the knowledge and the um, uh, tools and techniques that I learned in the last five years of my personal development field exploration and that five days boot camp and the hundreds of seminars that I've attended. So there is a the whole lot of thing that I'm going to share with you in the days to come. So I'm not going to make this video uh, longer, but I'm, I'll be try to keep this as short as possible. So getting directly into the <coughs> topic of the um, today's video. So how to get more clarity on what you really want to do or achieve in your life. So this is the first thing, what you are passionate about. If you know that you have something that you are passionate about, then that is the thing that you probably should probably do, you know. Is, is there anything that you love, you know, doing all night long or you, you are not tired with, even if you do it for two days, three days, four days or maybe, you know, this is something that doesn't let you sleep or this is the something when you are working on it, then um, you don't you know feel like or you don't have any you know that sort of distraction thing coming and um, diverting you because you are so much focused you know I recall Enrique Iglesias uh, once in his interview uh, in the VH1 right saying that you know when I'm writing song I'm just writing song everything completely disappears so is there anything like that for you are you so passionate about anything that when you are doing that particular thing everything completely disappears maybe it is like you know taking photographs you are you have the so much you know that sort of passion in photography or maybe you have something in, like speaking you are so passionate about speaking that when you uh, get to speak you forget everything else or maybe you are like you know um playing football or maybe you you want to play cricket is that your passion you know is, is it something when you do that thing you forget everything else but only that particular thing so if that is your passion then why not make that passion your profession why not take action to uh, turn that passion into the profession and you know make that your career because at the end of the life when you look back at you know for the life for the all the years that we have lived then you will realize that i have done the good thing because i had you know passion for that thing and i really love doing that and i lived what a life you know what a beautiful life i have lived because i enjoyed it throughout my life and it was such a rewarding career that i had so this is the first thing find out your passion or do you have any passion so maybe this is the something that should give clarity on what you should do okay and if you don't have passion and people say no I, I don't have anything like that you know no I am not such passionate about maybe you know like photography I don't have passion about singing or maybe uh, there is no anything like that you know I don't have any passion yeah that is not no, that's completely normal for you not to have any passion okay say so then ask yourself look at yourself and say second thing what are you good at okay what are you good at maybe it, it not necessarily be your passion but you could be good at you know what is it what is that thing that you are really good at maybe you know it is um could be like um writing or are you good at writing or maybe is it like uh, it could be you know singing are you good at singing it you ne not necessarily be passionate about it but you are good at it you know people uh, around you are saying that oh pj you are really good at speaking oh you are really good at playing through it oh you are really good at this and are really good at that so maybe it's time you know to look at look at yourself and find out what you are good at and figure out the ways to make 
the career in that particular thing that should help you because you know if you are good at something then maybe you know you will enjoy doing that okay so if you are good at something and if you if you don't know what your passion is then obviously i think um in my view that it is the best for you to go ahead and take that thing as your career so again now coming to the last point and i'm going to end up a wrap up with this point so first thing if you are if you have something that you are passionate about then get you will get the clarity of what you really want to do in life second thing if what you are good at if you don't know that even even if you don't know both of neither you know that you are passionate about anything and you know that i mean uh, you cannot figure out that even if you are not good at anything so then last thing or the third thing that i'll suggest to you to get more clarity in your life what you really should be doing is ask yourself this question what would i be doing if i have only one year to live what would you be doing what is that thing that that you would love doing what are the goals that you would love accomplishing what is the work that you want to do if you have only one year to live you know i have only one year to live and i'm going to do this oh my god i cannot be wasting my you know days because every second counts so what is it that you would love doing if you have only one year of time left at the beginning of this year i have shared that new year video what if this year was your last year to live so in that video also in continuation with that thing i'm uh, you can uh, watch that video and in in continuation with this i'm sharing this with you that ask yourself what would you be doing if you have only one year to live and that this would give a complete clarity on what you should be doing okay so i told you the three things three ways that you could get more clarity or clear picture of what you should be um doing in your life if you have not you have not yet that clear picture of what you should do or what you want to do so first thing if you have passion make that passion your profession second thing what you are good at look at yourself ask yourself maybe yeah, if you don't know what you are good at you can ask the people around you you know what i'm good at can you tell me or maybe you know by yourself that i'm really good at this then make that your profession and if you don't know uh, these two things then third thing is ask yourself <clears throat> what i'm going to do if i have only one year to live okay thank you so much for watching and i will be coming up with more videos like this and and please share this with your friends or family members who really need to see this and to get help them get a clear picture of what they want to do in their life and thank you so much for watching me